Hello folks, Tim here again with some more Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. Here we are on uh, day 37 and we are level 66, working our way up to 67. Let's jump right into what we've got accomplished the past couple days because I feel like it's huge. Um, you know, we did our arena. We're currently sitting at rank 716. Our fleet arena, we're sitting at 177, so we're getting our rewards daily. We're not doing fantastic. Uh, you know, win three, you know, lose a couple, lose three, win a couple. That's that's pretty much, that's our, our balancing act, right? Which is okay because we're getting what we want out of the arena. We're just getting resources, which is fantastic. In our galactic battle, for the past two days, we have fully completed the galactic war both days. And we did it pretty much on auto, which which was pretty awesome. We had one fight today where I started it on auto, and I had to back out and do it manual because we ran into like a level 70 Kylo Ren unmasked. So I had to kind of do him with the little system so that we could get him killed, which which worked out great. For our battles, we have not progressed anything. We just did our target farms for the day. Uh, we did all our challenges for the day. We got some more mods, so that was awesome. We did clear all our daily objectives, which was pretty much all we had time for today. I had a very busy day today. I had a lot going on. We were able to, to sneak in here, steal away a few minutes, and come in here and uh, do the All the Queen's Men 2 event. So we were able to unlock a three-star uh, Master Qui-Gon Jinn. And if we can build him up and come in here and do this tomorrow, then we will get uh, ten more shards. And we'll get some gear, which is awesome. Um, you know, we, we there's nothing more to do in here. It's just letting me do these battles over again. We did have the credit heist come up. Now... I have the required units unlocked to do the tier two, but I didn't want to spend. I, 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 we're 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 light on credits, right? We only have like a little over a million, and I didn't think that it was going to be worth it to spend all that right now and not really make it back. Like we could have probably maybe broke even, but we don't even have two point five million to bring them up to you know their intended levels. So we just autoed this. We collected 500,000 credits, which was which was fantastic. So I'm I'm happy with that, and and we will be building those teams up. You know. So speaking of unlocking things, we we did have some unlocks. So we did unlock the tie silencer, and then we went ahead and we brought it up to level 50. So I thought that was pretty awesome. Um. We did manage to unlock uh, Count Dooku. We got him out of a bron uh, the Bronzium data card. We were able to unlock Darth Maul, which was awesome. We were able to unlock IG-88, which I thought was fantastic as well. We did unlock the Boba Fett today, so that's huge for me. That's huge. There's Darth Maul hanging out right there. And, you know, there's Dooku hanging out right there. There's IG-88. There's Master Qui-Gon. We did also unlock Sunfac. So that gives us all three Geos that we need to go with their ships. We have not unlocked his ship yet. We're 8 out of 25. But we're buying that when we can find it. But I thought that was huge to get. We have all three Geos to go with our fleet. We have... Um, the tie of silencer to go with our fleet we have boba fett so we just need to get his ship so for the fleet that we pivoted to building we're putting the parts together and we're getting them fairly quickly which to me is um super awesome uh, i'm i'm really excited about where our account is going speaking of where our account is going character progression so we got chopper his seventh star today I thought that was uh, super exciting. So, you know, we're just, we're still, we're, we're not target farming Hera right now, but we will resume farming her once we get Captain Rex 
his fifth star. We will go back to working on getting Hera and Captain Rex up to seven stars and putting some, some stuff on them so that we can get the seven star unlock for the Emperor. Get um, Thrawn unlocked, right? And then get his seven star. So we're going to keep working on those characters. Uh, you know, we've gotten a few achievements done, so Vader is 56 out of 65, so we're creeping up on his 5th star. We got Mace Windu, his 6th star today, so that was pretty awesome. I was, I was pretty happy about that. We got Kylo Ren unmasked up to his 3rd star, because we're targeting him in that cantina store to get his ship. You know, we brought uh, Bastila Shan up to her fourth star. We got Mara Jade's third star. Out of the Bronzium data card, we got the fourth star for the Royal Guard. I don't know if I mentioned it, but we did unlock Darth Maul as well. Um, in our ships, we got another star for... Uh, the Geo Ocean uh, Spy Starfighter. So we have both of those at two stars so that's pretty awesome you know that that fleet's really coming along i'm feeling really good about that fleet i'm feeling really good about where we are in a lot of areas um for our shipments today so we just did our typical and and you know this is refreshed since i bought my stuff so of course you know that means we have to buy more stuff But out of our featured shipments, we just bought gear. We didn't buy anything out of uh, the we weekly shipment because we're not spending uh, the crystals. Uh, for the Cantina store, all we bought was Boba Fett, right? Because Chopper, we seven-starred him yesterday. So we just bought Boba Fett out of here uh, just so we could get him unlocked. In the guild activity, we uh, we bought Wampa Shards. So we're 15 out of 145 for Wampa Shards. We bought um, Han Solo, which we can buy again because it's refreshed. So 120 out of 45 as soon as I press this button. So we're going to unlock Han Solo in, what, two more days? Um... I also grabbed some General Kenobi shards, and we'll grab some more right now. So 25 out of 145 uh, for General Kenobi. And we'll scroll down because we are looking for Sun Fak. So we'll go ahead and get some more of his shards. So 16 out of 30. So we'll get another shard of him in, you know, two more days. But I, I feel like it's huge. We unlocked Sun Fac. You know, we got all three of the Geos for the ships. We just have to get his ship. And I don't know where it comes from at this point. Um, but we will find out. There's so much in here to buy. But I'm trying to stay focused. So in the squad arena, you know, we bought Mace Windu shards. We bought... Um, Princess Leia as well. So she's 42 out of 165. I'm trying to decide if I want to go for his 7 star right now or get some more stars on Leia. So we're going to hold off on spending these until later. In uh, the Galactic War store, we we did pretty well. We bought uh, the Geo Soldier Starfighter, which, you know, was... Uh, so we're 3 out of 25. The Spies were 3 out of 25 for that next star. So we bought that. We did, but we bought Wedge's X-Wing uh, as well. But that was, that was all we got out of here. In our Fleet store, we bought um, the Geo... Uh, I can't talk. Uh, the Geo Spy Fighter which isn't in here now, but while we're in here, we might as well grab some more shards of that. We bought uh, we bought Boba Fett shards, which I thought was pretty awesome. So, you know, working on, working on Boba Fett. 
and we bought the Geonosian soldier. Right now we're gonna we're gonna buy the spy. Even though we can farm him, we're gonna buy the spy. Because the Cantina energy that we have to use to get him, I would rather use to build up the TIE silencer. Um so I'd rather be able to dedicate all of my resources to that. Until we until we get that build up. Like I'm really tempted to buy Vader shards, but I know everybody's saying, you know, you're gonna get all his all his shards for free, right? So, um, you know, that's pretty much that's pretty much what we've been working on. And I'm gonna I'm gonna save these and and think about you know what I want to get with with those or just save them for tomorrow. I don't know. In our guild events, we didn't get anything because we don't have any currency. And in our shard shop, we are still just. Hanging out, collecting what we can get, and, um, you know, waiting so that we can get the good stuff. Hey, we completed an ob objective. Oh, we did our three store shipments. So, we're ahead of the game for tomorrow. That's pretty much it about, uh, for what I have for, um the account advancement but again i think it was a big day uh a big two days i should say that was a lot of unlocks we got a lot of characters unlocked we we did a lot of character progression which you know super exciting and you know we're gonna we're, we're just gonna keep uh we're just gonna keep going down that road and uh you know hopefully it's uh we have a, another great day tomorrow so before I get out of here, I, I want to pose the question to you folks is, yes, we do the updates and, and we've been doubling up, um, up and doing uh, every other day and just doing both days, right? Because they're really short videos if I don't, but I'm curious as to what kind of content that you would like to see. Like, what is it that I can, you know, make videos out of that you, that you all would enjoy? I would love it if you would drop that in the comments section and let me know what you want to see other than the daily updates. All right, so I'm going to get out of here. And I hope you all have a great day slash night whenever you watch this video. Uh, please hit that like button. If you're just finding us for the first time, please subscribe. And there is a playlist that you can that you can check out that goes all the way to day one uh and you can see our our track our progress that way and of course you know comment like i said what kind of uh what kind of content would you like to see what sort of videos other than the recaps would you like me to work on making all right guys i'm out of here see you later